Hi guys, it's Patricia, your independent Sensi consultant from Halifax, Nova Scotia, Canada. Today I'm bringing an updated Sensi Club video, an informative video about Sensi Club if you're new to Sensi Club or if you just want to hear about Sensi Club. And at the end, I'm going to attempt to show you my Sensi Club and we're going to go through how to edit something. Now, I didn't come up with that idea on my own. I watched fellow consultants Lisa Roberry's video. She did a wonderful job. I will put a link to her video down in the description box of the video. So you feel free to check that out because it's great. So basically, last time I did a Sensi Club video informing people about Sensi Club was when it first started, which was, I believe, September 2018. So here we are almost a year and a half later, and Sensi Club has made a lot of changes. But what is Sensi Club? If you are new to Sensi Club, you're thinking, I've heard all about this, but I don't know what's going on. So Sensi Club is a program that you sign up for. There's no cost involved. There's no obligation. You can cancel at any time. And what it allows you to do is get consumable items delivered to you on a schedule that you pick. It could be every month, every second month, or every third month. You can have a combination of those and you can always edit your subscription, which is wonderful. Now, consumable items mean items that are used up. Things like wax bars, oils, um, on-the-go products such as room sprays, scent packs, scent circles, car bars, things like light bulbs, things like cotton cleanups, things like go pods, laundry, cleaning products, body products. You kind of get the idea. Things that are excluded might be a little bit faster. Things like warmers, diffusers, things that are kind of not consumable. So things that don't get used up. So obviously you don't use up a warmer, that kind of thing. Do you see what I'm getting at? Buddies, things like that would not be included. So one thing about Sensi Club is there is something that we can talk about later and it includes skipping shipments and that factors in bars that are get discontinued. We're going to talk about that in just a second. But let's talk about the perks. There's kind of three main perks. The first one is reduced shipping and sometimes it can be free shipping. So let's talk Canada first. In Canada, the base rate is $9 and you go up past that to 10% anything above $90. In Sensi Club, if you make it to a $40 level, your shipping goes down to seven. And if you make it to an $80 level, your shipping is free. So that is great. I always strive to get to the $80 level because I don't wanna pay for shipping if I don't have to. And in the US, the base rate in the, um, the continental U United States is $7. With Sensi Club, if you get to the $30 range, your shipping goes to $5. And if you get to the $60 range, you get free shipping. Now, that doesn't apply to um, Hawaii and things like that. They always have their own little special thing. And I always refer you to the frequently asked questions on the website. They're very well done. So that's where I got most of my information. Perk number two is you get access to bricks. Now, in the past, you had to meet a certain dollar amount to get access to bricks. Sensi has done away with that. Now these bricks are not bricks that you would see for the spring collection. They're not bricks that you would see for the holiday collection. They are 11 selected bricks that are usually fairly good sellers, if not top sellers, and you can purchase them for $24 in the US or $32 in Canada. You can add them to your, any Sensi Club subscription. There's no minimum fee to do that. Now I will tell you, bricks are about 5.75 bars of wax in one big giant brick but you're paying for the price of four bars. So it's an excellent savings. If you like any of these scents and you tend to warm these scents a lot and you're purchasing these bars a lot, you would probably be better off buying a brick. So I'll read you the scents. Baked apple pie, black raspberry vanilla, blueberry cheesecake, coconut lemongrass, luna, perfectly pomegranate, skinny dippin', which is usually just a spring and summer scent, keep that in mind, but you can get it year round in a brick. Sugar cookie, sun-kissed citrus, vanilla bean buttercream, and welcome home. <clears throat> now, some people ask, are they going to change the bricks? Are they going to update the bricks that you can choose? I would not know the answer to that. I think it would depend on popularity of scents. They have actually reduced the number of bricks that you can get, so that would be something. And the bricks don't come with the traditional scentsy um, coloring of that particular scent. They come with a brick, just like you would see on the... Um, thumbnail for this video. So the third perk is the always get my bar feature. And to me, that is probably the best perk that Sensi Club offers. And remember, it applies to wax bars. It's not always get my scent circle. 
It's always get my bar. So what that means is, if you put a, a bar in your Sensi Club and it at any time is discontinued, as long as that bar remains in your club, you will get it made just for you. I'm sure there's other people that probably have it too, but they will continue to make it even if you're the only person to have it in their club subscription. And you will continue to get it on your delivery shipment. Now I'm gonna to talk to you a little bit about delivery frequency, so pay attention to that when we get to that segment. But the other thing you wanna make sure to know is the only way that this would not apply is they did mention um, if there was a fragrance oil they could no longer get, they might not be able to make you that bar. The other thing I, th I remember hearing was with regards to Disney and licenses, if that license expires, then obviously you would no longer be able to get that bar. Now the always get my bar feature really plays into scents that are retired or discontinued. You can put anything in your Scentsy Club that is current and those current scents are very easy to change. The ones that are retired and discontinued, those are the ones that are a little bit more complicated. One feature of the always get my bar feature that I really like is if a seasonal brick is announced, such as a spring brick or a holiday brick, you can add that brick scent into your Scentsy Club. They will not send you in brick size, but they will send you it in bar size. So what that means is Candy Cane Wishes, for example, came out um, in November. And if you add it to your Scentsy Club, they will send it to you in a little bar. So if you don't want to buy a whole brick of something, but you want to sample all those scents, then you would probably add those to your Scentsy Club, sample them out once you get them, see what you think, and then decide if you're going to keep or get rid of them. Now, in saying that, anytime there is a limited time offer, such as bricks, um, collections, things that are only around while quantities last. Whatever the launch date of that item, you have up until 30 days to add it to your Scentsy Club. If the item is still available after that 30 day time frame, you can add it until it sells out. Once the 30 day time frame has gone by, if it's still available, once it sells out, that technically is it. Now let's say a limited time offer bar is um, put out February 1st and it sells out 10 days later. You still have 30 days from the start date, February 1st, to put it in your club. So just keep that in mind. That is something that Sensi has done for us. And sometimes, I don't know if it's that they make mistakes, but sometimes you can go in and see what bars you can add. And sometimes there's bars that you can add well past the 30 day mark. So always double check what bars you can add because sometimes there's, I don't know if they're glitches or just, you know, generous oversights. So one thing to know, if a bar does make it into clearance, you can no longer add it to your Scentsy Club. So anything in clearance or flash sales, those kind of things cannot be added to your Scentsy Club. The great thing to do with things like scents of the month, bring back my bars, retiring scents that go away every six months, those are the ones that you wanna capitalize on the always get my bar feature. Something you might wanna know, talking about skips. Let's say money is tight for you and you want to either skip a shipment or skip a portion of a shipment, you can do that. You can do that once per calendar year if there's any discontinued fragrances slash bars in your subscription. If you have all current scents and you can get them currently, the skips don't really matter. It only matters if you have discontinued bars in your Scentsy Club. So if you skip a shipment, and then you go to skip another shipment, it will tell you, warning, you've already skipped a shipment. Now, I have not personally received this warning. I haven't tried it, but I have heard through the grapevine that it does tell you. So I'm just taking people at their word for it. So that is something to know. If your credit card auto payment is refused due to insufficient funds, et cetera, et cetera, maybe you didn't update your expiry date, they will attempt to contact you a few times. I forget exactly how many times, but if they cannot contact you and it's refused due to fund problems, then that counts as a skip, so keep that in mind. Okay, let's talk about frequency and how to pick frequency. You can pick once a month, every second month, or every third month. Now, when you're coming to your pick your bars and how often you wanna get them, one thing you wanna make sure is if there's a scent that you love, my advice to you is start with a high quantity and a very short frequency because you can never increase the number of bars that you get on a discontinued fragrance and you can also never get them quicker. 
So what you want to do is you would say to yourself, okay, I want six bars of winterberry apple tea and I want them every month. So later, if you start building up a stash of winterberry apple tea, you, you might say to yourself, maybe I'll go down to three bars every month. The alternative would be maybe I'll keep the six bars, but change it to every two months or every three months. Once you've changed something, you can no longer get it in bigger quantities and you can no longer get it more often because what Sensi has to do is they have to budget out how much they need to make of that particular scent. So they can't be saying, oh, well, we now we need to make more because this person changed their mind. You can always change your mind to go with a lower number of bars on a discontinued fragrance and you can always change your mind about getting not getting it as often, but you can't do it the other way around. So that is very important. Now, year, uh, years ago, a year and a half ago when Scentsy Club first launched, there were a lot of issues. People weren't getting emails. You now get emails 10 days before your shipment that you can, there's a certain cutoff date um, before your um, processing date, I believe. You have 10 days to continue to edit and they will tell you and then there's a certain date after that you cannot make any changes. And then your um, payment method will be charged and they will ship the product out to you. Now, <clears throat> when we first started Scentsy Club, you could not make changes. so. You might have a six pack and you were stuck with whatever you had in the six pack. Now you can edit out bars. You have to be careful if it's a retiring scent. It, it will give you a warning if you want to delete a retiring scent, but you must be careful. There's little garbage can symbols that you just have to be careful not to click because you don't want to make a mistake and delete something. And what we'll do is if I can do it, we will go through my Scentsy Club and I will show you some things. Now, I think for the most part, I think I probably talked about everything I wanted to tell you. Hopefully I did. If there was anything I left out, leave it in the comments below. Now, one thing I want to tell you is when you're going to do your Scentsy Club, every time I want you to think to yourself, do I need to add in any of these following options? Because sometimes people forget them. I often forget them. Bulbs, cotton cleanups, whiff boxes, and very importantly, any of the scents of the month, because you can actually get the scent of the month feature in either the bar, the scent circle or the room spray. So that's always a nice thing. Sometimes it's good to pick up the whiff box, great for gifts or great for yourself. So the other thing you wanna do is always check down at the very bottom, there's a feature that says promotions. And like I said, check that because right now they're, and we'll see if it's still there, but the last time I checked, they still had the harvest collection of three cents. They still had the fireside collection of three cents and they still had the, the five brick cents, two of which are still currently available, but because they're in the regular catalog. Um, the other thing is very important to strategize. If you can, I always advise people to do a bundle and save with a three pack or a six pack because you at least want to save some money. And if you can do the six pack, that's even better. And now that you can edit things, that's better. Some people still put bars in individually because as they edit them out, they don't want to be committed to a certain dollar amount. I will leave that guys, I will leave that up to you. In the 10% off months, which are now January and July, you will still get the 10% off price, but you do not have to reach a higher quantity to get your standard shipping that you would normally get if it wasn't a 10% off month. So just keep that in mind. That's a nice little perk that Sensi does for us. And when you're setting up a Sensi Club, you do have to go through a consultant. The reason is, is you have, any purchases have to go through a consultant. Does that mean you have to talk to your consultant? No, you can just be a silent shopper if you, if you would like. Um, with my online customers, what I usually do is if somebody orders from me the very first time, I send them a welcome email and I kind of let them know that I'm not the type of consultant that's gonna bombard you with information. I have a Facebook site and you're, you're welcome to go there and check out things, but I don't send a lot of individual correspondence unless it's something that's very pressing and I need to get a hold of. But I'm always there to answer any questions that people have, that kind of thing. And so, so that's just my style. I mean, that's what works for me. Maybe the people that shop for me, shop for me because they like that style, I don't know. But I, I'm personally not someone that tends to overly communicate with people and that's probably against the Sensi's rules, but <laughs> anyway, that's just my style. Um, so yes, one other thing is if you sign up with a consultant and your consultant retires, you do not lose your Sensi Club. It will actually roll off to their sponsor. What that means is it just kind of is like inherited. It's transferred to another consultant that your original consultant signed up under. So you don't have to delete your Scentsy Club. Now, the only thing that might apply is if you are 
a customer and then you become a consultant. That gets a little tricky because you're still signed up under your consultant and now you would probably prefer to get the commission yourself. So just something to know. Now, one other thing I did notice as a consultant, it looks like some of the fees might be changing for Sensi Club Commission. So just something to think about because I saw it in the back of the, the catalog, although we have not heard anything about that. We're gonna break off and I will get to my Sensi Club. Okay, so this is the best I could do because I suck at technology, but here I have uh, Sensi.com up. Basically, if you go to choose a consultant, and you can search by someone near you, or you can search by name. So we'll just go search by name. Now down here where it says country, I'm gonna change that to Canada because we're gonna look up my site here. Oh, not Austria, sorry, just one sec. Canada, there we go. And I am in Nova Scotia, so I'm gonna go over here and change it to Nova Scotia. And then you can just type in, what I would type in would be Patricia. And just press search. And there I am, the second one down. So I will select and search. And this is me, so I will press select. All right. So there we have it, there's my site. Now, always if you can, up here it's a shop a party. I always encourage you, if you're just doing a regular order and it's under a party order size, just click on this because you help own any local host that I may have. So that is always nice to do. Now what you do is you come up to menu and you tab down to where it says my account and you go to My Scentsy Club. Now, if you're just setting up a Scentsy Club, what I suggest you do is look through the frequently asked questions and walk through it. Here we have me and my Scentsy Club. So it says my next shipment is scheduled for February 18th, and I have one, two, three six packs and a Disney six pack. So what you can do is you can view by clicking this or you can just press edit and you can also view that way. So let's do this. We're going to edit and it will show you your one, two, three, four. So let's just check the first one here. So we're going to view it. So in here I have sweet plum pastry, marshmallow mint, banana berry, hazelnut frosting, cozy spice and rosemary mint. Now let's say I want to switch out rosemary mint. What I would do is I would press edit. And right here, it's the very last one, rosemary mint. So you can exit out. Now because this is still available, it did not give me a warning. If that was no longer available, it would give me a warning. So let me go down and we could pick if you want to pick a scent that starts with S, you click on S. Let's say I'm going to add a Snowberry. Snowberry is retiring, let's add that. I usually do not add current scents to my Scentsy Club because I just usually use it for things that are retired. But what we'll do is we'll go up here and save it. And then it will go back. It says item updated. And if you click on this again, it will now show sweet plum pastry, marshmallow mint, banana berry, hazelnut frosting, cozy spice, and snowberry, okay? So let's see what I have in the next one. I have love and happiness, woolly slippers, sugar, snow kiss cranberries, silver bells, and vanilla mint. Now I did go and already edit these, so there's not really much to show you, but in my third one, I have simply vanilla, coffee tree, luxe vanilla, Peppermint Dreams, Cozy Cabin, and Summer Rain. Now let me show you something if we go to delete something that's no longer available. So I'll just show you what happens. Let's say we want to delete Cozy Cabin. Cozy Cabin is no longer available. If you press this, it's going to come up with a warning. Yes, it says this is basically, are you sure you want to remove this bar? It's no longer available, blah, blah. So no, I'm going to put no, keep this item. 
but that's the warning that they're going to give you. All right. So let's just go back for a second. Let me add, oh, I'm gonna, I'll show you my last six pack, which is with my licensed bars. Here it is. This one has Olaf, two Tutti Fruities, a Star Wars light side of the force, because I want to try that one. It has Stitch, which I've tried, and Angel, which I have not tried yet. So that one. And every bar that I've picked, if you look here, it says ship item once every three months. They're all in a three month. This is the garbage can I told you to be very careful about. Don't click on that. And here's the, over here where it says skip, skip. Um, you can actually skip a whole shipment as well. Now let's add something. Let's add a six pack. Let's add a pretend six pack. And I might keep this. So you can, when it prompts you, here's your bundle and saves, car bars, car clips, fragrance flowers. These are all the things that you can get. Now I always encourage you just as a special thing to always look for the promotions here. This is very important because this has a lot of the bars. So let's just look in here first. Sometimes this has your hidden gems in here. So we have the Bring Back My Bars, we have Angel. Here we have the Harvest Trio. Here we have one of the Fireside Trio. So you can see, and here we have some of those bricks. So you can see that there's a lot of special somethings in here. We have Inhale, Exhale, we have the Bring Back My Bars, but I wanna just show you if I can remember, oh, I think it might be gone now. The other day, summer rain was still here, but now it no longer looks to be here, but it might be in the regular section. So anyway, let's go back up. We're just gonna exit out here. And this, we'll see if it's in the other section. So let's go up to bundle and saves. We're gonna add a bundle and save. And I'm gonna do the six pack of bars. So let's tab down. Not the Disney six pack, the regular. Here we go. Now it says here, build your subscription, six Scentsy bars. So one, one I know I would probably want would be Cider Mill and Cedar Cider. So let's put both of those in. Cedar Cider and Cider Mill. And let's also put Cozy Cardigan because I do like that one quite a bit. Cozy Cardigan. Um, the other ones I probably would add would be Winterberry Apple Tea. So here's Winterberry Apple Tea. Um, what else would I add? I'm trying to think. Well, let's add the Rosemary Mint that I deleted because I, I would want that. Rosemary Mint. And let's just see by chance if Summer Rain is in this section because some people really like Summer Rain. And here it is. So always kind of search a couple spots. So Let's add Summer Rain, even though I already have it in there. <laughs> and that should complete our six pack. Okay, so what you're gonna do is press save. And then it's going to show you up here, which you can't see because I don't have it, but up here is your little shopping cart. So it's assuming you wanna add more products, but let's just say you wanted to just add that, you would click on your shopping cart. And it's gonna prompt you and ask you how often says review your subscription. Here we have Cedar Cider, Cider Milk, Cozy Cardigan, Winterberry Apple Tea, Rosemary Mint, Summer Rain. And then it says, do you want it to ship monthly? I would probably want to add it to ship every three months. To add with my bars, up here you click add to subscription. And that is as easy as pie. Now you can go back to manage subscription and then it will show you. Now, I have an extra six pack and here it is. The one I just added, Cedar Cider, Cider Milk, Cozy Cardigan, Winterberry Apple Tea, Rosemary Mint, Summer Rain. So that is my Scentsy Club. I hope this video was helpful in some way. Let me know what you guys are adding to your Scentsy Club and I will talk to you guys in the next video.